dope people of YouTube, how are you all bloody doing? I'm Game of Madness, you may call me Madness if you so do wish. And we are yet again here, here in Rome, Total War 2. Yes, we are. Now, we just won a battle with this army, the Scare Army as we call it now. I figured we would. And, our general leveled up. Actually, he didn't. It was, yeah, it was the general. We got this perk, Formidable Fighters which gives our every 3% weapon damage inflicted by all melee units. It's not too bad. Now, I am debating with myself whether or not to just go head on and attack here. As you can see, the garrison is not really anything to be worried about. The only thing that's really annoying about wall cities is, you guessed it, the wall is really fucking annoying. Now, this army here is gonna pose a serious threat. Because it can take out this city without really, well, with no trouble, I guess. Uh, yeah. If we do take the city now, I guess this army will have to move and it won't make it in the next turn. And there's attacks here. So what we're gonna do is, we're gonna buy some more cav. Because if this army attacks, these guys have no bonus against cav. And they're real bad. <laughs> so hopefully we, run, we can run through them, or at least kill them in close combat. These guys is what I want to get to with my calf. I want to kill all the slingers. Alright, so what we're going to do is, we are going to attack. Well, I guess now is the time, eh? Ooh, what are we getting at here? There, oh no, there's going to be a lot of shooting. Hopefully we can get into the city before um, before the enemy reinforcements deploy on the walls. That would be nice. We're gonna assault now. So I am hoping I'm gonna get a little more close combat footage for ya, where we go down and actually watch the fight. But the thing is, it's really hard when um, when you're trying to control your entire army. Um, but I will try. I'll do my best. I do apologize that I haven't been doing a very lot of that. But hopefully I'll get better at controlling my army and therefore uh, better at getting some shots of the close combat. Now rain. Rain is not going to work too well for us because we want the scare army. Right? It's a scare army. We want it to work. And so we need fire arrows. And fire arrows, as you can see here, it doesn't work in the rain. So we're going to wait. A dry day. Well, no better day to die in the desert but a dry day, eh? We got the men we want on the actual ladders, which is good. We don't want to attack here, there's four towers. What we're gonna do is we're gonna send one ladder over here, and then we're gonna deploy our the rest of our army. Wait, right, like so over here. That way. Well, I don't know if it still works actually, but at one point it did actually trick the AI to, to deploy all their men where the most of your army was. Because the most of your army was there, so they're gonna deploy there. And if you do this, then you can flank out with one ladder. And my plan is then to get the guy with the ladder, get him up here, and all the way over here and capture the gates. So we can actually just walk through the gates. That would be, well, an advantage, I guess. Let's just get this sorted out real fast. Uh, yeah, let's just go for calling them one big group here. Put them all here. They won't be very useful in a town. I'm not saying that Cav can't be used in a town, because it most certainly can. And does quite often. I've done it myself a couple of times as well. But, I do find that good infantry is the way forward when taking a city. Alright, we're just going to start the bell here. And get attacking. I will speed it up, this up. I will. Now, while this is happening, I will show you some little, a little still shot here, eh? The men do look good. Oh, wanna put the guys in phalanx? Look at this. Boom! Phalanx! Ready to rape some people. Crocodiles looking awesome as ever. I do like it really do. Now, 
I guess I'm gonna try and go in a little Oh well No I'm not I'm gonna tell you a little bit about the Scare Army Not that I am really good with it But I will try to tell you what the idea is For the new people I felt I have kind of explained what the general idea is Which is kind of self-explanatory But The thing is When you have elephants They absolutely trounce infantry Unless they have pikes so these guys who like mow down their lights, you can actually charge head on and kill people. But I usually I don't want to do that if I can avoid it. Because what I want to do is pin the guys, like pin the enemy army, say with these men, if I'm attacking or if they're attacking with my spears. Say the enemy is attacking, I want to pin him with my spears, get these guys into the flanks, like so. Boom and boom. And then I want to get these guys behind my spears to just start scaring them, just drop their morale, get my archers to fire fire arrows to again drop morale. And then I want to get flank or rear charges with these elephants and these guys, because see, flank and rear charges in itself give a penalty to morale. Then being shot by fire arrows also gives a penalty to morale. The crocodile warriors does it, and the elephants does it. So there's going to be a lot of stuff going on with it. Oh, let's see here. We're coming onto a wall and they have mob here. It's a little sad that they're called mob. I like I like the word plebs a lot better. <laughs> so if I use that I do apologize because it usually just call them plebs because I like I like the word so much. Oh, sorry about that. Let's see if we can get some of the kill moves on here. Oh, that guy was stabbed. That's unfortunate. If he wanted to live. Which I'm taking he did. Alright. And he is being killed. I don't know what to do if we actually take the city, which we most likely will. I don't know where to go. We might ta try to take the rest of the province that we are currently in and taking, but they have two or three big armies, I reckon, because AI with one city can apparently support a lot of men. Um, also, I have been trying to reach out to a couple of YouTubers. Some of them big, some of them not. I have been getting response, which actually surprised me. I, I don't know why it does, but I guess I really never thought of myself as someone people would actually respond to, and they did, and I'm so grateful for it. Um, so something might be going on with that pretty soon. I do have some things in the makings. Uh, hope it will work out fine, and hope it will come up pretty soon, but that's gonna be a little surprise for ya. Oh, hell yeah. Um... And also, that should be a good way to get the wheels rolling on this channel. Um, because one subscriber is an amazing guy, another subscriber is yet another amazing guy. So, I reckon that if you subscribe to this, you just enjoy the small things, because I ain't really a tactical mastermind or anything like that, and I ain't no great spokesperson, but I do enjoy what I do, and I generally hope it comes off pretty good. And if it doesn't, well, I'm having a good time doing it. Ain't nothing wrong with that, eh? Uh, yet again, I am open to suggestions and, like, tactics, so... If you have anything on your heart, just throw it at me. I'll take it up. I do generally hope that someone will interact at some point. Not that I need it, but... It will be lovely to hear what you guys think, whoever is watching it. And, uh... Well, any input at all. You can also criticize me, like, constructively. Because I want to get better at what I do, and... Well... If no one's telling me what I do wrong, I won't do right. Oh no, this might be harder than we thought, guys. Yeah, because these guys are just going to wreck my men while we're fighting. Alright, we need a new plan, don't we? <laughs> this might take up the most of the video then. But, it's all good. It's all good. Maybe we could just go down. And like, go to this gate. Now they have stuff over here as well. Alright. Well, crap. I'm getting a major lag here. I'm sorry about that, guys. I don't usually do that. I have a pretty good PC, I feel. Alright, we're going for it. What's the worst that can happen, right? I guess we're gonna be trying to use the ladders after all, then. Alright, here we go. You take... You take these ladders. No, run, dude. Yep, running. These guys take this ladder, and this guy take this ladder. 
Elephants can't break down walls, can they? Or like gate. Ooh, no, they can throw torches. That's not what I'm going for. Why did these guys stop moving? Don't stop moving, guys. Damn, I need you. Oh, this might be our chance. Brush the slingers. Take them out. Could they? If they throw spears on the wall, that would be amazing. Oh, they don't. Well, didn't think they would, but I was hoping. Not gonna lie, I was. I am lagging so bad. I am so sorry. It must be the city, but usually I don't. Well, I'll look into that after this video. Hopefully I will improve a bit as well. And also, if you guys could l just let me know if the audio setting is too high or too low, or if it's just good as well, just let me know. Give me some feedback, because... Like, even when I watch my video, because I do, because I want to see what I do and where I fuck up and all that kind of stuff, uh, I might not be able to hear it because I kind of already know what I'm saying, so if it's too loud, I won't be able to hear it, or if it's too high, I'll just go, now. Nah, it's fine. Um, you know how it is, right? Improvement is always easier coming from someone else because they're watching it with fresh eyes. Alright, we are on here. Let's just start pushing. Oh, damn, we're on pretty far away, though. I guess that's my own fault, to be honest. Everything is going alright, though. Because these guys should cut through these guys. Here. And they are, but we're being shot in the side by these guys. And that's really damn bad. We're going to sacrifice some archers here, and we're not going to use fire arrows, because I'll show you. Actually, I'll show you. Because of... This right here, damage, re reload time. It like it reduces the damage, and raises the reload time. So they shoot less arrows a minute and does less damage, due to the effect that actually lowers enemy morale. And we don't want to lower morale right now. We just want to kill these guys because these guys right here, some of them, or well, most of them, I guess, are not actually in cover behind these here. Well, I don't know what you call them. But behind the wall, you know what I'm getting at, right? So, we might be able to kill a fair few of them. Let's do that. I know it, like, exhausts them, but we really want to cut through them now. Where are these guys then? Alright, shoot. They have more guys here. It's Javelin Man. They might not be able to reach us from here. And I am just fine with that. We are gonna lose a lot of men, but gotta sacrifice. It's true. Oh no, this ain't going too well, guys. And as I said, there will be no reloading, like loading a game you already played. Oh, what's that? That's archers. Damn. Yeah, they are. Egyptian slingers are not very good. No, not slingers, archers. That's what I'm trying to say. Um. Yeah, they have low armor, low morale, all that, all that kind of stuff. Because they're cheap, and as I said, normally I just want to be using them for um, the scare effect ability they have on their flaming arrows. So I guess I was kind of asking for it. They die really fast. If used properly, though, they will do a lot, and I mean a lot of damage. Because here, that is like the worst way to use an archer. Just head onto a wall, normal arrows. Just, they got the wall cover and they're being shot at by slings and archers and the towers. Oh wow! Are they gonna get this? Yeah, they are, aren't they? That's amazing! We might lose. We will not be defeated. I could have waited for artillery too, but I didn't wanna. I don't know why these guys are not cutting through them. It must be because there's like... How do you say that? Oh my god. We're getting wrecked. We could just flee and then cut losses, I guess. I mean, this is kind of futile now, isn't it? Does this have oil? Gatehouse? No, I don't think it has. Let's go burn it then. Let's try it out. Let's burn that to the ground. Right here, over here we made it. Which is all good. We are gonna have to rebuild this army big time. 
Let's pull back the edges a bit. The elephant might be able to save the day if the enemy actually gets down from the wall. Which I am hoping they will. A lot. Yeah, they're getting kind of quite tired. Should be able to break these guys pretty fast though. Over here we are wrecking. I reckon. Yes, we are. I some of the kill moves here. Oh, what's shooting at us? Oh. Javelin then. Oh, they're running into combat or what? That would be fairly stupid. Oh, wait. Wait, 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 no. I've got a plan now. I don't know why I didn't see that as an option, but I could've just gone here. Taken this stuff like the gatehouse, and took taking my entire army through here. Don't know why I did. Don't know why I didn't. Yeah, this is an animation you don't see too often. Actual siege stuff, getting burned, and being burned and destroyed. I like that. Our men flee, the field of Our men flee do they? The what? What? <laughs> they just got wrecked! What's up with that? Ooh, who's shooting that much? An Jesus! All right. Well, I guess we're gonna have to push in here. This, I am sorry. I thought I was better than this. Damn! I need to up my game. But it's okay. It's okay. Sometimes stuff doesn't go the way you want them to, and it's okay. I guess the thing about deploying one ladder one place and the rest of the army another doesn't work quite as well as it used to. But, oh, we still have these guys alive? Oh, why aren't they winning? Well, no time to complain. We're getting the guys off the wall. That's good. We're moving forward here again because I failed. This will help us when we throw the torches. I will do this because it will give them a bit more of armor and thus they won't die as fast. And that's a good thing, I feel. Weird, right? We need to get to those guys, so they just... They they will not be able to wreck us, like, with just plebs. Oh, mobs. Shit, I'm sorry. I want him to be named plebs so bad. Because plebs is just an awesome word. Don't know what it is about it, just like it. These guys are still running towards us. Yes, they are. They got all their shooting here, though. You see that? That's gonna be terrible. Fuck that. Go here. Go the torches, people. See, our men aren't very good at all. Oh, this... I sh probably shouldn't be watching it like that. That's gonna fuck up my game. Yeah, yeah, my game just totally broke. <laughs> I'm sorry. I am. Now who's fleeing? Oh yeah, they lasted a good while, but they didn't do nearly as much as I was planning them, planning them to do. They're just getting cut down now. Look at that! Would you look at that? That is this. This is bad. Like this. This battle is being lost. Proper lost. I don't know why I'm lagging so much. I must have too much going on on my computer. I'm truly sorry. All right, G give me just a minute, will you? I'll just. Back. I don't think that worked. I couldn't seem to find anything that was going on. All right, this is bad. This is. <laughs> well, let's just get it over with then. No, we are gonna lose now. This is way too much for us. At this point, I think that. Can we flee? Yeah, we can. I think we're just gonna flee and cut losses. Sure, because they have too much shooting for us to handle. But they must be running out of ammo. Right? They must, surely. I was so sure we could just wreck these guys. Like, I really was sure. Well, guess not. Alright, we're almost through. We're just gonna try. Let's do it! Oh, I'm lagging so much. It's unbearable. I am sorry, you guys. I want it better for you. Well,. I guess you'll have to wait for it then. We should be through the wall pretty soon. Eh? Let's 
If I turn my back, I'm gonna lose a lot more men. Let's not actually. Let's just wait it out. We're almost through. We're gonna. S what we're gonna do is we're gonna send the calf in. We're gonna try to do this, the cheatsy way almost, and just run him into the center, and trying to take the square and make it count down. But look, would you look at that? Just we took an absolute beating with a big ass B. Let's go here. All right, let's go in. Why are they? Oh, I forgot about him. That was my bad. Damn. All right. I have no more apologies to, to make. I, I'm just fucking up from now on. It, from now on, it's just on me. Oh, this guy. Yeah, it's a shameful display. Look at that. Just look at that. Just damn javelin man. Doing so much damage. And so should they. They have barely any ammo. Compared to stuff like slingers who have like in unlimited amounts almost. Oh, we're not gonna go there with our spears, we're gonna go all the way over here. And we're just gonna hope that some of the units make it. We ain't quitting yet, people! Hell no! I could try to get my elephants in, but that would be... ...kinda stupid, because... ...a little bit of javelin and a little bit of fire ammo will just mm, wreck up, I guess. So, I'm hoping that when I get into the center, these guys will go off the wall to try and capture the center. And if they do so, I will send in my elephants. Oh, something is here. Let's kill that. Kill that. Actually, no, just kill that, because you're going to get a charge on that, aren't you? Yeah, you are. And that will wreck them. It should. No, it didn't, because we have, we have, like, no charge. The enemy has captured the gates, and so should they. It is their gate, after all. Can I reach anything? Nope. Alright. Now... I am starting to think we might do it, but it is gonna be, like, with way, way more losses than I hoped. And expected as well. That was bad, wasn't it? Oh, oh, they're in shield wall. And there's 200 of them as well. That was the general ship. Yeah? Where did that come in? Look at that. I reckon the general 200 men unit must have been on this ship. They look good, the ships, I feel. How are you guys on naval combat? I never really played it because, well, just... It seems a little clunky and people... Like, the AI just spawns, like, spams a lot of missile ships. And just ram you. And uh, that is viable, I'm not saying that it's not, because it totally is and it's smart, but it's just annoying to fight it. These guys should be able to just get em, make them go away in combat. Just don't even recharge. And they will do. They will do it. And if they don't come down, we're just gonna get a cheeky win. But I really totally should have lost this battle, because I have played it like shit, <laughs> to be honest. But it's okay. It's all good. If we get it, we get it. If we don't, we will get it later. There is no not getting the city. This is already mine. They just don't know it yet. That's right. Let's see if we can capture some of the uh, sweet, sweet calf fight animations. Though. Cattle man! There's actually one where the horse... I don't know if the camel does it, but where the horse just kicks a guy square in the face. <laughs> That's awesome. Oh, we broke him. We broke the general unit. Let's try to kill him. Let's try to kill him as well. Mounted units can't capture um, the square. They can only make it neutral. The same with towers and stuff. They can't capture it. I have to dismount for that. And I don't wanna. So everything in here is just gonna die, pretty much. That is the thing with the wall. When it is used properly, or whoever is attacking is just a dumbass like me, it... <laughs> What's going on here? Is it sticking? Oh, he had it on his back, did he? That's pretty cool animation. Wonder why all of them aren't doing it, but... Oh, never mind! And we got the square now, and here they come. Sure as fuck. 
Let's just not allow them to throw javelins at us. Because if they get all their skirmishers off their walls, they won't be a problem to kill. Just look at that. These are like pretty bad units in like stats wise. And still they're just killing the skirmishers off. And so should they. So should they. They really should. Chase them out of the square. Let's make this city mine. Here, yeah. And it's gonna be a bit longer than normally due to this combat here. Well, this fight. But it is a big city. Hopefully, we're gonna do way better in, like, every other siege battle ever. Because if we don't, we're gonna get raped. Alright. That unit went away pretty fast. Let's just fast forward this and see what the AI does. Oh, looks like they're staying. That's interesting see because they have me by the balls if they played this like a human would like a real ass person they would absolutely destroy me let's just in case just get the calf into some charge positions here so they can actually wreck enemy units I guess I'm just gonna get them here these guys over here so we can get some rear and flank charges going on which is what 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 happened here I just saw the uh yeah, 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 what are they shooting at? Oh, poor guy! Oh, they, they didn't hit him! Get him! Oh, they're not shooting no more. Then I don't wanna watch it. Oh, I've gotta stay in it? Alright, 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 I'll stay, I'll stay, I'll stay. Yo, man, I'm here! Oh, I'm taking it, I thought I was losing it. Oh, that might be it. I didn't even see those come up on me, did you? Oh, they are coming down the wall somewhat. Oh, the tower shooting as well. I am a moron. I am an absolute twat. <laughs> this is going so bad. I am like amazed that I'm doing so bad I wouldn't call myself a bad player at all at least not against the AI maybe against the human I would suck balls but normally I do better I'm disappointed not bad disappointed like mum always said well, that's pretty bad all right then we almost got it as you see it might be doable it might I hope it is I really do they lost it yet another victory point. Alright, so we are gonna win, but it's gonna cost us a lot, a lot, a lot of men. And I did, really didn't want that, because if the other army attacks, like the big army with the slingers, we might not be able to win. Especially if they actually learn how, like if the AI actually learned how to use siege equipment. Jesus Christ, I suck at talking as well. Alright, we are gonna win. And we took, this got to be like a pure victory or something like that, because that was bad. That like hurt all the way into my brain to see that. <laughs> okay, we won. Costly victory. Damn right it was. Let's end that battle. Yeah, look at that. That was just mostly on me. That was all on me, to be honest. I was getting a little loose with it, and we paid the price. It was a pretty steep one as well. I guess I take the calf thing back because at the beginning of this battle I was talking about how calf usually isn't very useful and the calf totally won it for us didn't it well there you go oh we lost like our infantry our actual close combat infantry but it's okay we're gonna occupy the city we will just do this real fast um yeah all right we got the city as far as good oh we have no money do we Let's just level this up then. This is the army that actually leveled up as you can see here. We just leveled up and we now have 20 XP to go. No, it's the general. What am I talking about? It's the general that leveled up. We're gonna give him this ability, soldier. A good soldier knows much of the world and most importantly his place in it. Plus two seal when general, which I find weird because he's always gonna be the general. And plus ten charge bonus for all units, army only. That's fair enough. We're gonna take that. 
and I do believe the next level we can actually pick the one where we start to lower enemy ro enemy morale. Gravitas does not very good. Spear ramp is pretty, pretty good. <laughs> no, why would we take that? That's that's pretty stupid. All right, we're gonna take this heroic hoplite. To be heroic in a phalanx is truly worthy. Plus five percent melee attack skill for all spear ramp units. That's pretty good since we have a lot of spears. Alright, that gets us all I have time for now. Don't forget to comment, rate, and subscribe. And if you do have anything you want to tell me, please open your heart and tell me. I guarantee I will answer you. I hope you have an awesome day. I'm signing out, and as always, let the madness loose.